uh, that was great. First of all, I didn't know he did the Martin Lawrence theme song. My and that's him. Yeah. Martin Luke, and he does the Bill Maher. Bill Maher. Bill, Bill Maher that he produced. Talented. I didn't know he he wrote all the rhymes for Kid and Play. He wrote all that shit. Yep. He's a very, very like talented guy. Like on yeah. like producing and stuff like that. Yeah. And 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 he and he did stand up. <laughs> I'm gonna give the Denzel left. <laughs> yeah, he did. Yeah, yeah, he did stand up. Yeah. Kid, kid, you did stand up. When you 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 jumped in our our our, our ring, didn't you? Didn't you? You 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 motherfucker! You 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 jumped in our arena of what we do. You know, I mean. <laughs> I don't know, fuck that. Uh, kid stand up is suspect at best. <laughs> and you know what? This is from one light skinned nigga to another. Kid, your stand up is suspect. And you know it. If you weren't in house party, you'd be doing open mics in Jersey. You know I'm telling you. You'd be doing open mics in Newark. That's what you would be doing. You'd be, you'd be, you'd be, you'd be sucking cock in Poughkeepsie. You'd be sucking cock in Poughkeepsie. That's Say what you would be again, doing. motherfucker. I dare you. I double dare you. Does no, what no. look like a bitch? Does comedy no, he, look no, he's like funny. a bitch? Then why are you treating it like that, then, huh? Why you treating it? Why are you treating it like that, huh? Man, have is a comedy a bitch? What does comedy look like? What? Like, Say what again? What does comedy <laughs> look like? What? Say what again, motherfucker? I dare you. I double dare you. <laughs> does, is Man. comedy a bitch? Then why are you treating it like one? Huh? But, but I just thought I just thought I'd tell some jokes. <laughs> <laughs> May I have a taste of your your tasty burger? Yeah. Yeah. Man. <laughs> Yo, and he didn't get an award for that, which is, which is the most ridiculous shit. He didn't get an award. Who got nominated? Get nominated though. nominated for no, that? Who did get nominated shit. though? Who did what? get nominated? No, one of them got nominated. John Travolta did. John Travolta, which but, they were both great, but Samuel Jackson was the best thing in fucking Pulp Fiction. I'm Pulp sorry. Fiction by far. No, him and Ving Rhames. I did like Ving Rhames. Even though he got butt Big fucked, Big Rames got fucked in the ass with a ball in his mouth. Okay, but I like the you know the, the, the video. Okay, wait, wait a minute. Bruce Willis and Ving Rames were both tied up with balls in their mouth downstairs in the basement with the Zed guy. Right. So they were like, "Which one you gonna take, Zed?" And he goes, "Eeny, meeny, miny, mo, catch a nigger by the toe, blah blah blah." He picks Ving Rames. Right. Then what's his name leaves. All of a sudden, he, you know, Bruce Willis finds a sword somewhere, and you know he's coming down, and you hear noises going, "Yeah, yeah, yeah," and it's Ving Rhames with a ball in his mouth getting fucked in the ass. Big old yeah. Marcellus Wallace is getting sodomized by a, a white dude, which symbolically was disgusting was like, let's break this black man down. Then he did Holiday Heart again. It's like, whoa. So yeah. Remember, how he was the dressed up. Okay. So yeah. he's getting fucked in the ass. And then remember when Bruce Willis kills all of them, right? Kills them right. all. And then <laughs> it was actually funny when he goes, uh, you okay? He goes, no, nah, man, I'm pretty, I'm pretty far from okay. <laughs> After getting funny, he goes, so what now? I'm going to tell you what now. I'm going to call a couple of hard pipe hitting niggas to go to work on the homes here with a pair of plies and a blowtorch. You hear me talking, Billy boy? I ain't do with you by damn sight. I'm going to get medieval on your ass. And he Good says, shit. <laughs> he's like, you be gone and you stay gone. You lost all your L.A. privileges. Remember he said that to I But got I just did like... Oh, you sound exactly like you. Like, number you one, talking hillbilly boy. But but you, I don't know if you can do uh, the holiday heart one because that. No, I'm good. 
I'm good on that. Pause. Yeah, that part. Yeah, I'm not but doing you know holiday hard. You know, you know why a lot of people got movie, but I'm not. But it, I'm not watching. It, it was it was paint by numbers. It was horrible. Um, <laughs> it was horrible. No, it was horrible. But the part that the, they didn't like about Ving Rhames is when he gave he wanted to give his Golden Globe to Jack Lemmon and start crying. That was weird. And that was that was so uh, weird. Weird and and like and and dumb. Just, just, like, take your fucking trophy and shut up. <laughs> shut up, dude. You, you he goes, big... Jack Lemon. I think that you shut up, Irving. His so real name's Irving. His name yeah. is Irving Rains. Irving. And now he's he now he's doing me. now can you can you handle the meat? Now that he's doing yeah, that commercial. We handled the meat. So, yeah. I'm yeah, like, so... no, you got your meat handled. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's true, man. Like, why is it that with black actors, they got to be some kind of way where they bring them down a notch? Yeah. They got to do. Well, look at I'm watching. I mean, no, 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 no jabs to Chris Tucker. Like, they're right now, they're showing um, um, Rush Hour 2, but he, you know, Fifth Element, I couldn't do it, bro. I couldn't uh, do it. I, hate it. I was like, said, why do you. Know, Chris Tucker wasn't a da 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 da. He was messing with women i go but why was he in a dress why was he why was his shoulders out with the little i was like oh my goodness I oh, no. never do that. They, they were trying to say he was just flamboyant but he wasn't nah, gay. Nah, man nah man next minute they're gonna say he knew jujitsu stop <laughs> stop i love when stop. they do that they'll go no man you know he he, he had a vagina but the nigga was magical <laughs> And why, yeah, and why? And why? And why? Remember, remember, First Blood on HBO, the vampire one. Yeah, it was the va First Blood was the vampire um, series, and the black dude who he passed away, good actor, he was in James Bond. Right. He was wearing makeup and lipstick. I go, why is there? Why is the black vampire wearing makeup and lipstick when nobody else is? Well, no, he was the he was the. Why cook. can't I just be a vampire with my teeth? Why do I gotta put on eyeliner? Because you have to, you have to uh, minimize their their masculinity. Does that but make the sense? The vampire. Th it was called True Blood. I'm sorry. It was True, True Blood. Blood. I'm thinking of um, was Rambo was First Blood. It was True Blood. Yeah. Um. But why? But he was he, the, he was a, he was the cook. He wasn't a vampire. He though. was the cook. But then he had eye shadow. I was like, what? Right. It's just a vampire. Why is he wearing? I. It was weird. Because the people who write stuff like that feel like, and I'm not saying all you motherfuckers that wear all that shit, good for you. But in films, it's to, to minimize us. I don't care what nobody says, it's to minimize us. When you got Wesley Snipes, who is one of the top action stars at the time, I mean, Passenger 57, if you look Blade, at some of the movies, Blade, Rock like, Zone, right? Murder at 1600. Boiling point. Uh, boiling point. Well, action. Well, action, martial arts. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Or action or where he's has strength. And that movie was, I, and I don't know why Wesley did it, but I, other than money, but I, he didn't have to do that. He was well, still Tu-Wong in a position. Fu. But here's the thing about Tu Wong Fu. Everybody was dressed in a dress. It wasn't just the black guy. It was it was Liguizamo, Swayze. Patrick Swayze. It was a it was a tribute to Julie Newmar, who was the first Catwoman before Eartha Kitt. And it was like at least it was all of them. It but usually it's just us and everybody else is cool and we're the ones, you know, prancing around in a dress. You know Even the I mean? dude that, the dude that's playing Blade was a gay character in the uh, Academy Award winning. The in... Green Book. Yeah, he was. Right. He was he was gay in that and he also was Oh, in moon, not in moonlighting. No, he wasn't. In moonlighting, in moonlighting. no, no, not moonlighting, not moonlighting. Uh huh. What other? But, but for green in in Green Book, he definitely was. Well, they showed the scene where you go, oh, he's gay, but they didn't do any stuff. They didn't show. They didn't that. show. Yeah. But they, but that maybe that was a true story, like right? because it's supposed to be based on a true story, even oh, though they made true. it real. They made it kind of soft. I hung out with the director because the, the my manager was the uh, was the. Uh, um, had a client in the movie, and I went to the after party, hung out with the director, and some of the Green Book stuff was softened up because it was worse than that. It was worse than, than yeah, the but, movie? But they always have a save a Negro uh, thing when it comes to... <laughs> no, but you know when it comes to... <laughs> Wait a minute, did you say you know save the, a you know Negro? The white man save a nigga movie? Yeah, okay, here's an example. 
like hidden colors, right? Hidden yeah. figures. I'm sorry, hidden figures. Hidden figures, that part in hidden figures where you see uh, Kevin Costner tearing down the signs for the bathroom, that never happened. The lady, the actual black woman that was in there, she goes, that never fucking happened. We were treated like shit. Like, but they made the white man the savior again to, to, to you know lessen what? the blow on their evilness. And even in Black Panther, there's a there's in Black Panther who oh, one of my favorite movies saves though. The world again, right? I go, yes, we got all but these it is powerful still... African warriors, and this little corny white dude goes, "Is it this black boink?" <laughs> <laughs> the white dude literally know. saved the yeah, world he... again. I go, "How the fuck did this dude with all our smart? The girls were smart. We had the warriors, and this white dude goes, "Okay, I'll do my best." Hooray! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I pressed the right button. I, oh what my God, say? He saved the world again. I think he pressed the button um, in uh, privilege. Okay, there we go. Yeah, yeah because it, 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 <laughs> yeah, it, it was a privilege button. Yeah, without, why did they, there was all, all the people they could have picked. They could have picked yeah. Siri. Siri could have been the one. Siri could have saved that, but they had the white dude just go, and they do it all the time. They did it in Mississippi Burning. They did it in, um, um, Time to Kill with Samuel Jackson after they raped. They had Matthew McConaughey just save the world. Don't worry, I'm going to get your daughter justice, man. Like, yeah. <laughs> be, because, because, because. Well, it's the writers. It's not just, it's the writers. Well, too. it's the deflection because our history is so horrific that I don't think anybody could really stomach it if they really got down to what really, right. really, really, really happened to black people. Nobody could stomach it. I don't even think we could. People would be right. leaving the theater crying, and people would be fighting and wanting to because the way we were treated right. is so horrific. You can't even imagine, dude. They were cutting black women's stomachs open with the fetus in it and stomping the babies. They would and throwing the baby to crocodiles, throwing the babies to crocodiles. The crocodiles. They would they would work on women on black women's vaginas with no anesthesia. And then yes. just do whatever and rape them and, and then tie black men to the horses and their horses would run in different directions, splitting the bodies. They, they're they not showing any of that. You and know why? What they because, did. But that's why they don't want critical, critical race, race theory. Critical race theory. Exactly. They, they, they don't because want, they don't want they don't, the little kids, that, little white kids to feel bad. They don't want the little white kids to feel bad. They don't, they don't want, want critical race fact. Yeah. But no, I mean... There's, has there been any movies where there, uh, like all the way back to Michelle Pfeiffer, there was a movie she was in where she was the teacher that came to save the little. That black was uh, Dangerous Minds. Was that Dangerous, what, Dangerous uh, Minds? The, yeah. Coolio had a song in it. Dangerous Minds. That's the only reason. Yeah, that's the only reason I, 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 I even remember part of the movie. I just couldn't stand it. I'm like, so none of these black teachers can possibly teach the same shit. Is what you're telling me. Wait, who wore dresses? They said Sean and Marlon, Keenan Thompson, and Tracy, they all wore dresses. Well, yeah. Oh, 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 Hold oh. up. Wait. <laughs> Wait a minute. Okay, Sean, the Keenan? The, you know what, Keenan? Oh, yeah, on SNL, many times. Dressed up like old I, I never watch. Like, yeah. I never yeah. watch. I never watch. You know, I, I mean, I like him, I, and I'm, I'm happy for him. <laughs> But I, I can't I can't watch them. I can't I can't watch them. <laughs> like some shit I don't watch. I mean I, I like I'm telling you right now, there's some movies where I go, even if I like the black actor in it, I know that there's gonna be that savior fucking figure and I can't watch it. Yeah. I, they weren't I, on Saturday Night Live like they did. I don't know I don't know fashion guy okay. White chicks they did it. Chappelle wore a dress in men in tights. No, they were dressed as Robin Hood guys. That's how they all dressed. That wasn't that wasn't a dress. No, he wore a dress. What? Where? Yeah, and no, Chappelle did in in men in tights. No, he wait. Instead of the Robin Hood thing, he had something else on. Yeah, yeah. They both that he dressed as a woman to, yeah. Oh shit. Even the Rock, even though I'm a fan of the Rocks, I'm a fan of the Rocks, and I'm looking forward to look seeing Black Adam because I think that shit looks hard. He wore a dress in a movie where he was the two fairy. Oh shit! No, if you think about it, and he wore, no, he actually wore a tutu. You know, do anybody yeah, oh, in the yeah. feet know what a tutu is? 
Wasn't that the, the, the protector? No, not the protector. The babysitter? No. No. Oh, the Vin Diesel. Oh, he, dude, he, wow. At the Rock. His big ass, this giant Samoan nigga had on a tutu. He did. He had a tutu on. I'm like, did y'all really need to put him in a tutu? Did y'all yeah. really need to do that? Yeah. And even and Kevin Hart at the end of the movie where he, in Netflix, where he was the father and the wife died. I can't remember the name of it. At the end, he has a dress on. What? A dress. He dressed like a woman. Yes. Wait, when? On Netflix. It's on Netflix where he's Wait, a father. Are you out of your mind? Somebody what? in the feed. What's the movie that uh, Kevin Hart was in where he's a father? The is wife. It fatherhood. Yeah. yeah the father. How is, is he, a father? How do you wear I a don't. Dress? Is he's a father? Think... Where did the dress come from? It went from fatherhood to motherhood. <laughs> No, that's that's actually a good bit. That's a good bit. That's a good bit. That's the truth. That's a good bit. That's a good bit. Wait. No, that's the truth. How did it go from where did he why did he wear a dress? It made no sense. The, end, the last scene. On the end. Credits roll. Yep. Wait, what he what what what, has, what what does it how did he get in the dress? What happened? He was say he was making a point that to make his daughter feel good that he would wear it. He would wear a dress. There's nothing wrong with it. There's nothing wrong oh, with it. But it was like, no, they snuck they, it yeah, she didn't like wearing dresses to school. She didn't like wearing dresses, so the father decided to do it. Yeah, what? A, you know what? There's a different way to teach your kids. You don't really have to do that. That's <laughs> weird. You know what? I'm gonna wear the dress then. <laughs> yeah. I, so I, what? Uh, yeah. The, ask no, her he did she, not. Yes, he did. Look it up. Look it up. Last scene, everybody yeah, in the feed. I'm Becky telling the there. truth. What are you talking about? There's a. What are you talking about? You, is there another chair? Can you move that that stool? But it was, but no, I mean Kevin Hart. Kevin Hart does good work. I'm just saying. Kevin's especially, my man, but I didn't know he he had a he did a, a joint like that. And he did that. and he did it. He did that, and he also did it on Saturday Night Live. Oh yeah, I know. But that movie, it made no sense. It was like they like, threw it in there, like, yeah, let's just throw it in there. Really? Yeah. At the and I'm talking about the last scene, the last scene, and I just didn't, I didn't get it. I did, I, I didn't get it. I, 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 wow, I did not know that. And I don't, I don't know. Maybe that's just a Hollywood thing. That's just a Hollywood thing that they need to do, or I don't. You know, a lot of these independent movies, like I've done some independent movies, and even if they thought about asking me, I go, you know what? I I I got money in the bank. I'm leaving. I would just leave. You know? Wow. <laughs> yeah, but I like Kevin. I like Kevin though. I do, and I really I did, did like True know, Story. I didn't see that movie, but I didn't know he wore a dress in that one. The movie's <laughs> good. The movie's good, but the ending is. It made me. It took it down four notches. Has Mike Epps getting... wore a dress? I think Mike did. No, I know he. Has I know he? he put. I know he played a. I know he played a gay dude in um, either it's SVU. He was really. With, yeah, he was a gay. He had a gay dude. Yeah, boyfriend. Yup. Yeah. I saw it. It was SVU or one of them. It's a Law and Order. Yup. Yeah. Will Will Smith has done it. What? Well, Will. Yeah, Will did it. There was his um, first movie role he played and 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 again people in the feed it ain't against gay people it's just it just seems like no it's not they do. just we're just talking about people who played roles that's all. He played a role uh where he was he he kissed a guy who I can't uh Will Smith Oh 6 degrees of separation Same shit it's it like was, it was 6 degrees and Will and even Denzel told him you know you don't need to be doing that right <laughs> And he, and he did it anyway. And Will was like, in West Philadelphia, born and raised. <laughs> <laughs> Smell yeah, you later. Yeah. <laughs> no, I just feel like I, you, you, that won't happen to you. It won't happen to me. But there's some people, they feel like, hey, it's comedy. Hey, it's, you know, Flip Wilson did it. I had one agent tell me that because I didn't want to go in. Wilson, that was, Flip Wilson wasn't forced to do it. He made those characters on his own. He was his yeah. show, and he he did a lot of characters. That's different to me. That's not the same. 
Because back then, everybody was doing it. Jack Lemon, Milton Burrow, everybody played everybody women. Everybody played women. Right now, it's just a little different. They kind of no, single us but out and unnecessarily. I had an agency drop me, and luckily I had another agency that wanted me right after that. Because I wouldn't go in. They were going to remake Bosom Bodies, Bosom Buddies, and they wanted yeah. me to go in for Tom the role. I, and, and I said, no, I don't want to do that. Find another role for me. And they, then they called me like four times. Come on, Shang. I mean, Flip Wilson did it. Martin Lawrence does, did it. Eddie Murphy did it. And I'm like, well, that was them. That's not me. And I'll be fine. I'll go back on the road and make a lot of money. I don't have to fucking do it. And I didn't do it. 